on to Bro Bridge, not too far from the river, and surely a must-see. There don't seem to be any records of when the first bridge was built across Bayou Teche at Bro Bridge. In the 1766 Spanish census, this place was called La Puente to indicate a turn here in the bayou. In any event, in the Civil War, the bridge here, either the first or the second built, was intentionally destroyed by the folks who built it. You see, the federal troops were coming into town and the rebels were forced to flee up the Teche to Opelousas. They were taking on supplies at the very last minute before the Yankee occupation from four steamboats. There was the Darby, the Louise, the Blue Hammock, and the Uncle Tom. Leaving behind only a few snipers to harass the invaders, the rebels all escaped. The bridge did not escape destruction. Its flames could be seen for miles around by Utesh as a last desperate symbol of Southern independence. This is the sort of place where kids still lay down their bikes to buy a pop at an old store. It's the sort of place where locals and visitors lucky enough to stumble in sit for long lunches. This is the Café des Amis, and its genuine charm fits well into our expectation of a Cajun town. It wouldn't take a lunch hour to feel the genuine romance of Brobridge. Brobridge is not a put-on for the tourist, not a put-on at all. It seems to know its way just fine. <laughs> 